hard, cold, tumble of a journey, worthy of a gurney, a bumble down, a slapped face, snapped with a mace, certain to the base as you stumble down. It's a path that leaves a stain at home, but we want to help you, so we will bring some fun, fresh, entertaining videos during your time of social distancing. Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Paul. This is Lori. And we are here to first of all say hi, hope everything's going well um, during our time of social distancing. Um, and to let you know that what GCPA is going to do is we're going to be adding some content daily where at 4 o'clock every day we're going to post a new video, uh, a, a post about meeting us live to, to stay engaged through, throughout this time. And we're going to have a lot of different activities, information challenges to help our creative outlets stay open during this time. And we're calling this... Everyday Every day. GCPA. Yeah. We might have some vocal warm-ups, a dance sequence. Um, it might be an acting game that, mm -hmm. that Paul might do. Um, and then we might even have, like like we said, live time with question and answer time. Yeah, so so if you would, when you're engaging with us, use that hashtag Everyday GCPA. And, and that way it allows us to, to see what you're doing as well. And, and we're th looking forward to staying in touch with you all because you're our family too. Yep, absolutely. And speaking of family, what we're going to do right now is we're going to show you a little bit about where the Pagano family is going to be doing our work over the next couple of weeks. All right. So this is the tour of our office slash music room. Uh, this is where I teach my voice lessons when I have people here in person. Uh, we were just sitting at the piano a second ago. Um, and of course, this is actually where I'm going to be teaching online voice lessons with my St. Louis University students starting next week um, because we have moved to everything online. Um, I'll probably have my computer there. I'm going to have, I actually just ordered some equipment like a, um, some headphones and a little microphone to make the experience better. Um, we've got lots of music books here um, to choose from when I'm teaching lessons. Got some pictures if you want to see it. Paul and some shows. Ooh, there's Paul on, on the shows. There's me in an opera. Oh, there's there's Kalia in one of her shows she did um, at St. Louis University, actually. Um, if we turn around to the left there, you'll see the desk that I'll be working from for the next several weeks. My day job has sent all, all people who can work from homes, home to do so, and so I'm going to be working from home here for the next several weeks as well. So we'll be spending a lot of time in this room together. Yeah. And I have to kick you out when I need to do my virtual lessons. Yep, sure um, we are a very musical family, as many of you know. We've got tons of instruments in here, other than the piano. Let's see, we've got an alto clarinet. We've got a saxophone that Xavier plays. Down here we have three clarinets because I played clarinet and I still do. And both of my kids took after me and played it as well. <laughs> Over in this corner, we got lots of stuff. We have... Um, a classical guitar, an acoustic guitar, uh, four ukuleles, and a, um, I play guitar, Kalia and I play ukulele, and we've got a violin that we want to learn, so it's over there. <laughs> I also have a mark tree that we used in our last show. Um, and down here at the bottom, down here at the bottom, woo, is um, an actually an accordion that Paul had to play in a show. And maybe we should pull it out and start learning it during our time yeah, off. Probably should relearn it again, it. yeah. This is our favorite thing in our house, probably. One of our favorite things in our house Absolutely. is this wall of posters. And we have a feeling that it's going to keep on expanding, probably head that way across these walls eventually. Um, the top two rows of these, so the first 11 you're seeing right here, are all shows that we saw on Broadway in New York. Um, and, and Harry Potter. And Harry Potter, yeah, that's 11. Um, <laughs> um, and you know, best wishes and we're keeping our fingers crossed and our thoughts are with everyone that is, um, affected on affected Broadway, on Broadway, and, Broadway tours and tours and across small the country, companies and all, all artists everywhere. Yeah. Where our thoughts are with you. We are having, we had to close our show too of you're in town, not close it, postpone it, postpone it. Um, the rest of the posters here are things that we've gotten signed when we've seen shows at the Fox. And or just some of our favorite shows. <laughs> um, all right, moving over here. We have a, our shelf full of stuff. We have tons of scripts and acting stuff of Paul's. Ooh, look at this. This is us in 2002 in New yeah. York. We're babies. And mm -hmm. most of you were not even born. 
Uh, we've got lots of musical theater scores, some opera stuff down here as well. Ooh, and let's look at this. We can't forget this. Oh, there's some stuff from uh, some shows. This is a show that Paul and I did. We did company in college. And look at him in the middle there. And I'm down there in the white shirt. We're so young. All right. <laughs> 20 plus years ago. Right. So that's, years the, that's ago. a oh tour of the space that we will be spending a good amount of our time with, staying creative. And we hope you guys stay creative too. So All that's right. a tour of our creative space. We'd like you to post videos and pictures of your creative space and hashtag it. Everyday GCPA. Look forward to seeing where you're working and uh, we will be in contact. Have a great day, everybody. Thanks. Bye. Bye.